when we are in our orgasmic bliss, when we are orgasming, and we've all, you know, we many of us may have had like clitoral orgasms. It's like a hot button orgasm. You feel it, you feel it, you feel it, you feel it. And we either let it release or we let it fade, right? Because we were afraid of it, right? But some of us have felt that deep, life-altering, life-changing orgasm that's, that lights up the entire body where we are, have no clue where we are. We're not thinking about our fat rolls. We're not wondering how we sound. We're not thinking if he's having fun. We're just laid out in bliss. And then when we come to, it's like, what the fuck just happened? And we are on a cloud for a week. That is a full body life-changing orga- like vaginal like orgasm. And that becomes the time that you compare every other time to. Remember that time though, it wasn't like that time. Well, that time can be every time if you train your body, mind, spirit, and soul into the deservability of that for yourself and for your life. Don't you deserve to feel pleasure? Don't you deserve to feel good? Don't you deserve to have what you want? Why else did we come here? Other than to live out our our bliss, other than to experience everything. And so the most important thing and the key to orgasmic manifestation is our intention. It's our intention. Our intention is the magic. Our words are our spells that create our reality. So if I want something, I must believe with my whole fucking heart that I deserve it. And then with that believing, I speak that into reality. And when I'm pleasuring myself, I am thinking about that. I'm thinking about how good it would be in my deservability to have that. I'm thinking about it like I, it's already here. When I'm walking around in life, I can do an orgasmic manifestation. I don't need to be alone in my room playing like with myself. I can be literally walking and just overcome with the idea 